like societally and amongst people who aren't medically trained there is a definite um a, a, a definite kind of prejudgment of what uh, what osteoarthritis is and part of our job is to make sure people don't feel like this unfortunate chap being being pushed off the cliff to inevitable knee surgery so these excerpts um here which i'll i'll pop up slowly are from a qualitative paper from a few years ago in italy and i'm sure if you're a physiotherapist and you're listening to this you'll have heard similar quotations similar thoughts from from patients i certainly have who kind of feel like this surgery is inevitable that it's your fate that don't really know how it works and hopefully um we want to we want to arrest in the same way we want to halt the arthritic process we want to try and arrest these feelings as well so trajectories and i probably should have um, put the ies in capitals here is a really important concept for this and making sure that people know that it's not like this <laughs> unfortunately the societal paradigm is once osteoarthritis starts it is inevitable nothing is going to stop um this this downward uh, trajectory but this this isn't really true uh, and a lot of people like this chap here will come and see you in clinic and they're quite fearful over what's what's going to happen from here on in if their knees you know been sore for a couple of years and now what happens next um it causes a lot of fear and we've got some pretty good data that like the chap being pushed off the cliff is not the case 